York are a team that have done a number on Toronto. We were here for the first ever defeat in the Wolfpack history. And these guys are going to be confident because they've built well, they've signed well, and it's the first day of the championship. And this is where someone earns the, the crust. Yeah, look, they're going to be out for a scalp, like I said. Look, what have they got to lose? You know, they've come at us hard. They've had a, a big pre-season. There's just nothing to lose for them. So that, that's, that's dangerous and we're, we're aware of that. They've got some great players. Ben Kane, obviously, equally as experienced as me, has been, been around a lot. Um, you know, they, they're a good side. We're, 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 uh, we're here to play, you know what I mean? We've, we've been building all pre-season for this, been working hard to, to, to start well. And At the end of the day, you can do all the talking you want. Everybody at this time of year where the Super League or Championship is in a good position, they think they're confident and they're feeling great. You know, there's no... Uh, experiences of this year to, to change that. So everyone attacks the first game full of confidence. You know, they'll come at us, we'll go at them. And, um, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see what the result is. But at the end of the day, it's all about actions. Um, our actions on the field will dictate that form and, you know, whether they want a scalp or not. If our actions are good and we get our actions right and we do the right things and set some high standards, we, we'll win today. You know, that's how I'm confident. You've done everything in the game. You've won it all. You've worked under some fantastic coaches. How's Brian Mack been? And you're working the real winner now, aren't you? Yeah, look, he's been outstanding. What one thing I'd say about Brian Mack is he, his, his messaging's so clear. Um, you know that he, he doesn't mix his words. He, he's got very clear sort of boundaries, and, and I think that's been great for this group of people. Um, we've been excited just about everything. Not only that, he's got two young coaches in, in um, Simon Finnegan and uh, Kate Agatey underneath him who, who, who are chomping at the bit to get up that coaching ladder too. So, yeah, I've been really impressed with Brian. I think you don't know anything about somebody till you work with them properly, you know, day to day. And, and, and obviously, Brian he coached against me at St. Helens for a number of years. Um, but to work with him really opened my eyes to really why Leeds was successful in that period.